Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel and in today's Grand Theft Auto 5 online video We're gonna try the street solo, you know, free car fully upgraded type of duplication, you know, thing we have going on right now and um like I said guys, last I did a video to this already and on the last video I kind of showed the perspective of your friend who would help you and on this video guys, I'm kind of going to show you guys the perspective of if it's you and kind of like what you need to do, alright? So, just so you guys can have kind of like something to refer, go and refer to in order to do this, whether you're helping your friend or whether you're the one that's trying to get the car and you need help from your friend, so, and then you can have them look at the one for your, you know what, it's just to cover all bases, guys, that's the reason why I'm making this other video, so, here we go, in case there was anything missed, um, you want to do benefactors, really works with any street car, any street car you want to get fully upgraded from the street and basically get your money back. If you guys can look at the amount of money I have right now, it's 381, 16, 242, so just so we can make note of that. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get everything fully upgraded except for the insurance, guys, okay? So I'm going to go ahead and proceed to do that, and I'm actually going to dashboard, kind of like how we dashboard on Pacific Standard when hosting. And um, but that's only right before quitting. So here I'm gonna go ahead and repair it. I'm gonna put armor all the way full. You kind of want to do this quick too, guys. You don't want to take too long picking a bunch of stuff because the game might auto save with all this stuff. All right, so you want this to work. So here we go. I'm just gonna spend for everything fast. I'm just pressing right up on the D-pad to kind of pick the most expensive thing. I'm gonna go ahead and put the most expensive horn. Of the lights, most expensive lights, neon, neon layout, most expensive neon color crew. Back and out. No, anything on the loss prevention. I'm leaving the tag alone. Actually, I'm gonna respray this to chrome so it's not hard to miss in the street. Okay, so that's done. Now I am going to add the roof, most expensive roof. Again, this is all we're doing, guys. We're just pretty much adding the most expensive thing highest level spoiler, highest level suspension, highest level transmission, turbo. Most expensive wheels, I'm going to high end and I'm going to pick the $25,000 one. I'm going to go to uh, wheel color, I'm just going to put black. I'm going to go to tires, tire design most expensive. I don't like to put bulletproof tires on my cars because there's a stance in glitch that lets you pancake the car and so I kind of like that. So Okay, so now that I'm ready, I'm just pretty much going to... Pr my friend, before I do this, my friend's going to be outside watching my car, okay? So once I'm, this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna press A, and then I'm now I'm ready to dashboard. I should be spawning outside. My friend will tell me. He just told me that I just went solid. So right there, I quit. Now I'm simply just going to restart the game. Now while this is happening, it's gonna say player left on the car that spawned outside where my friend is at, and then he's just simply going to follow that car, guys. Okay? Really, really easy. He's just going to follow that car for me. Everywhere it goes. Now, while that's happening, you kind of want to tell your friend to re-invite you to the same session uh, when he's basically on a red light behind the car. You want to make sure your friend doesn't bump into the other car. You want to make sure that your friend does not get in that other car. You know, that's pretty much some of the requirements for this. So, yeah, guys. So, um, I should be receiving some invites. There they are. I'm going to go ahead and accept these invites. It says invite accepted, so everything's looking like it's gonna work correctly. Yeah, guys, and I guess what we're loading, um, I wanted to remind you guys that I'm having a really awesome uh, giveaway for a modded account, and that's when I reach uh, 500 subscribers. And um, yeah, guys, it's really dope. Um, I've already have a winner picked out for the shark card giveaway, and I'm gonna be making a video for that one real soon. That's actually my next video, but I wanted to make sure that I got this little street card thing out the way since this is like the the best way to actually get free cars right now and money so we don't want to waste time on that one you guys need this already right away there's no way i can like take time and put this at the last minute when it's patched no way dude so here we go 
And um, yeah, guys. So you know how it is too. They might patch everything on Tuesday, so we don't want to take no chances. I'm just simply just driving behind this car. I mean, I'm sorry. I'm just simply joining back in, and my friend is is driving behind the car. About to load in. As long as my friend, okay. As long as my friend, like, never, uh, you know. Never lose sight of the car. When I spawn back in, that car is going to be driving around. It might even be an, an an AI with the same outfit I had on. Literally like a clone of my same character. You know, and that's all perfectly fine. That's actually what we want to happen. You know, and the reason why you want to drive real cool behind the other car, because you don't want to get into a chase with the other car. Otherwise, it may just get chaotic. It may break the car. So, yeah, we don't want that, guys. You just kind of want to just casually drive. You know, and this is the advice you want to tell your friend who's helping you, obviously. Now, I already spawned, so I'm simply going oh, to get hi. into a heli. What can I do for you? What vehicle should I tell them you want? Sure, it's on the way to the helipad. Alright, so I see my friend on the map. I'm simply just gonna drive to him. There he is. Okay, so car should be right there. And sure enough, there is my car right over there. I'm gonna try to land right in front of it as quickly as possible before the light turns. I just did that. And I'm simply just gonna get right back in my car. And if you guys can see, it's literally a clone of my character. Right there is a clone of my character, guys. I'm just simply not just gonna take this car back to Los Santos. Also take note of the money I have. You know, it's actually some back in my wallet. Before I do, I'm actually gonna put that back in. If you go back to the beginning of the video, you guys will see the amount and you know, actually, I got all my money back there, guys. So, this is really cool, man. You get a free car, fully upgraded, at no cost to you. So, right there, but yeah, there it is. 3881. Pretty much like what I had, basically, short of maybe three, four stacks. I don't even think. I'm going to have to go back. But regardless of that, you get the full money back now. I can actually drive this car back What's in. Wrong with her now? And I have two options. I can either put a tracker on it and keep it. As a personal fully upgraded vehicle that basically cost me almost nothing or nothing or I can pretty much just sell it guys and if I was to sell it right there I will get a hundred and fifty three thousand guys okay or I can simply just put a tracker and keep it now I already have one of these and I think I'm already hitting my sales limit so let me see if I can sell this yeah I can sell it awesome so I sold it so I got that much money and um, I'm pretty much not gonna add this up. And that's pretty much how we do this glitch, guys. Now, I could have kept the car, and I'm actually gonna keep some fully upgraded street cards, you know, for free. So that's another cool part of this glitch. Or you can just fill up, fill up a garage of these by putting, you know, rinse and repeat in this. As you guys can see, I have an extra 150,000 on the total balance that I had before, guys, okay? So that honestly didn't take that long, a quick 150,000, or it could have been basically this, uh, a brand new street car for free, fully upgraded, that would have cost me probably 300,000 in total to upgrade, but instead I got the money back, so it was really free, so it really was up to me, guys, and um, yeah, guys, that's pretty much how the other perspective of this glitch works, and, you know, you guys can help each other out and get money and get free cars fully upgraded for free, and it's, it's pretty damn cool, guys, so take advantage while it's out here. I'm gonna go ahead and, um, I'm gonna go ahead and, and wrap this video up right here, and if you, if you like the video, please don't make sure to put a like and subscribe to my channel, it would really mean a lot to me, and I really appreciate it, and you will automatically also enter my free money account giveaway and um it's, it's gonna be random out of the top people that supporters that i see just top commenters and stuff like that i'm gonna pick 20 names throw them in a in a in a in a web page where it lets you pick a random name and that's how pretty much we do that and um yeah guys um I, this is it for this video this is your boy glitch galore guys i'm gonna go ahead and sign off and start working on the next gta 5 online glitch video see you guys peace